The first section will discuss the basics of plane geometry. Definition Point A point is the result of the intersection of two lines. A point is usually represented by a dot and labeled with a capital letter. A point is the main building element of any figure in geometry. Any figure is the set of an infinite number of points. A point has no dimensions. It has no length, no width, and no thickness. Definition Plane Geometry Plane geometry is the science of measurement. It is the geometry dealing with figures in a plane. Definition Line A line is a figure formed by connecting two points and extending beyond each point in both directions. Lines are represented with arrows at each end. A line is formed when an infinite number of points lie next to each other in a straight path. Definition Parallel Lines Two or more lines in the same plane that do not intersect are known as parallel lines. In other words, parallel lines share no common points. Definition Plane A plane is a flat surface that extends indefinitely in all directions. It is typically represented by a parallelogram. The figure shows plane R. Definition Angle An angle is a figure formed by two rays with a common initial point. In the figure, the rays HP and HF share a common initial point. The intersection of HF and HP at point H forms angle FHP. Classification of angles. Angles can be classified by their measures as one of the following. Acute right, obtuse, or straight. Definition Right Angle If the measure of an angle is exactly 90 degrees, it is called a right angle. Angle ABC is a right angle. Definition Acute Angle If the measure of an angle is less than 90 degrees, it is called an acute angle. Angles MNP and ABC are acute angles. Definition Obtuse Angle If the measure of an angle is between 90 and 180 degrees, it is called an obtuse angle. Angle ABC is an obtuse angle. Definition Straight Angle If the measure of an angle is exactly 180 degrees, it is called a straight angle. Angle ABC is a straight angle. Example Classifying angles What type of angle is represented by the corner of a regular sheet of paper? Acute, obtuse, right, or straight? 
The corner of a regular sheet of paper represents a right angle. Angle pair relationships. Two angles can have the following relationships. Vertical, complementary, supplementary, and adjacent. Definition, vertical angles. Vertical angles are two angles that are across from each other at the intersection of two lines. Vertical angles are always congruent. In the figure, angles 1 and 3 are vertical angles, and angles 2 and 4 are also vertical angles. Example, vertical angles. Using the vertical angles below, find the value of K. Solution. By definition, vertical angles are congruent. Therefore, set the expressions equal to each other. 4K minus 23 equals 3K plus 9. Subtract 3K from both sides to get K minus 23 equals 9. Simplify by adding 23 to both sides. K equals 32. Definition Complementary Angles Complementary angles are two angles whose sum is 90 degrees. In the figure, angles 1 and 2 are complementary angles. Example, complementary angles. Angle 1 and angle 3 are complementary angles. The measure of angle 3 is 62 degrees. Find the measure of angle 1. Solution. By definition, complementary angles have a sum of 90 degrees. Therefore, the measure of angle 1 plus the measure of angle 3 equals 90 degrees. Substitute the known value into the equation. The measure of angle 1 plus 62 degrees equals 90 degrees. Subtract 62 from both sides to get the final answer. The measure of angle 1 is 28 degrees. Definition Adjacent Angles Adjacent angles are two angles that share a common side and a common vertex but do not overlap. Angles ABF and ABC share a common vertex and a common side. Therefore, they are adjacent angles. Definition Supplementary Angles Supplementary angles are two angles whose sum is 180 degrees. In the figure, angles 1 and 2 are supplementary angles. Parallel Lines and Transversals Two coplanar lines are either intersecting or parallel. When two parallel lines are intersected by a transversal, eight angles are formed around the points of intersection. Definition Corresponding Angles Corresponding angles are pairs of angles that are positioned the same at the intersection of two parallel lines and a transversal. Corresponding angles are congruent. 
Definition Alternate Interior Angles Alternate interior angles are pairs of angles located between the parallel lines on opposite sides of a transversal. Alternate interior angles are congruent. Definition Alternate exterior angles Alternate exterior angles are pairs of angles located outside the parallel lines on opposite sides of a transversal. Alternate exterior angles are congruent. Example Parallel lines Lines F and G are parallel. Find the measure of angle 8. Solution Angle 1 and angle 5 are corresponding angles, so they are congruent. Therefore, the measure of angle 5 is 113 degrees. Angle 5 and angle 8 are supplementary angles, so their sum is 180 degrees. Substitute 113 degrees in the equation for the measure of angle 5. 113 degrees plus the measure of angle 8 equals 180 degrees. Subtract 113 from both sides to get the final answer. The measure of angle 8 is 67 degrees.